Yeah, it's been raining all day in Seattle. Weird, right? <laughs> you know, we can spend all night long breaking down the different factors of what it's going to take to win this game tomorrow. But what really stands out, what matters most, is the health of Aaron Rodgers. And with his torn calf mo muscle, his mobility is limited and he's forced to stay in the pocket. Now that puts more pressure on the O-line to give him more time to try and find an open target. But this injury has changed his play approach. For most of Rodgers' career as a starter, he stays in the locker room until the entire team comes out. But part of dealing with an injury is figuring out what he can and can't do on game day and get acclimated to the conditions of the field. Now Rodgers says that playing with limited mobility is not a problem. Uh, well, it's, it's not uh, not real difficult. I didn't really move a lot in college. I had a great offensive line at Cal, and you know, it was just a matter of uh, playing within uh, within your limits with the uh, with the injury. And been pretty smart about it. I haven't really caused a whole lot of extra damage to it. And hopefully, it uh, just keeps getting better until Sunday. He'll be out there, you know, throughout practice and understanding, like when we watch it in the film room, you know, there's still the same amount of communication and understanding of what he still wants. So I don't think it really changes much. Now Aaron Rodgers says he only has 120 minutes left in him. Of course, saving 60 minutes for the Super Bowl. Now someone asked, really? 120 minutes specifically? He said, yep, I sure hope we don't go into overtime. <laughs> Reporting live from Seattle, I'm Lauren Majera, Newsline 9 Sports. All right, thanks so much, Lauren.